Scatterbrook Farm Garden Designs. Well, here we are again. Okay, so we've had an event. Um, this carnival event where we can win all these all these prizes. Um, now, I've had a, a request from one of my viewers. Um, could I do a design with the carnival um, deco that we've got? <coughs> Now, on looking at the deco that we've got, um, there was only one piece of deco that I, I really wanted, and that was the boat. Um, and the reason I wanted the boat is because I wanted to be able to incorporate that boat on my river, uh, by, my, by my farmhouse. Um, now, originally, when I got this, this first piece of deco here, Believe it or not, it's it's a tractor. Now, when that sat on the water, I put it in to start with, and it looks like a boat. Um, I remember D Daisy on her stream. I said it's a tractor, and she said, "Well, it looks like a looks like a boat." Um, oh, kind of Helen's ca uh, calling the cats in. Um, right then. So, decoration wise, what can we do? Not a lot. Um, there's not a lot you can do with that. Um, certainly, as 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 the way that farms go, um, with the decorating that I do, it's all like you know country gardens and and nice displays of flowers and trees and 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 things like that. With this sort of stuff, this is the sort of stuff that you can put on your town. I wouldn't, I wouldn't put it on the on the farm. Like I said, the only piece of um, deco that's missing there is the large boat. Um, and what I've done is I've incorporated the large boat onto my river, which I know you want to see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you now to the river and show you what I've done um, with, the, with the large boat that we've won. Now... Uh, I'll explain to you now as we go um, how I've done it. Let me just quickly just send me me Tom. I'm just going to quickly because it's the uh, double XP coins for the uh, tomorrow. So I'm building up as many of these gold blankets as I can. I'm 1,320 at the moment. It should get me around about two, two and a half, two point six million coins. Um, so how have you how have you all been getting on with all your uh, your tasks to try and get these decorations? Some of them, I thought that if you start trashing, it stops you getting to the end. But you actually got quite a lot of tasks that you can get away with trashing to get to the end anyway but uh come on let me take some time tom look perhaps he's getting on a bit now here he comes right then so that's that we put that into there okay then so here we go we're going to go and see the uh the boat on the river so there we are there is the boat on the river so as you can see, the way that I placed it, using the cover of trees, this side, so it looks as though they're hanging from the bank over the over the river. Um, and as you can see, on this boat, as our highlight, on that boat, there is a cow. Now, when you got, when I put the boat on the river, and I got that cow in view, it makes the boat look. It doesn't look right. Because the cow, as you can see, is 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 too big for the boat, and it looks it looks a bit it looks a bit strange. You know, obviously you can't even get in the boat. You know, he's nearly as big as the boat. So that's one of the things that I looked at and thought, no, I don't like that. Hence the reason I've covered it with that little bit of you know foliage just on the edge there. 
so you can just just about see him with his glasses poking over the top but the main of the boat itself is actually sat on that river now bearing in mind um, to have a design like this you need to have that river you need to have a decent river for it to sit on now obviously i can't do a video on on how you put the trees around because you know you could spend anything up to 35 40 minutes moving trees around just to get the right you know the right position on the boat obviously you can't go right to the very bottom of the boat because there's there's artificial water around the bottom which doesn't look right so you've got to cover it in such a way um and then what i've done on the far bank is i made a docking area obviously with some a muddy path there and a post to tie the boat up to so at any one time that that boat then can come off the main the main estuary come down the river and then he can just tie up to this area here whenever he you know whenever he wants if he wants to go and have a have a wander around the farm i've got the life buoy there which just just gives it that lovely effect along the river bank um, and like I said, with my designs, I try and imagine I'm there. Go to that place, you know, just, just imagine that you're there and imagine what it would look like in real life. And that's pretty much, as, you know, as close to real life as you're going to get. Um, and then at the back of the farmhouse, I've made this little alcove um, right by the river. And I've put the, the hammock. So again, it's a lovely little area for that hammock under the trees there. A little bit of shelter and you can just get your drink and just lie down on that hammock right by the river and watch the boat going up and down so that's quite nice and that's the reason that i wanted this boat um the small one which they called a tractor it did look okay but it was just a little bit too small it's okay if you've got a small a small river because it actually does look like a boat. But obviously this one's a, a much better size boat. And, you know, with the trees moving side to side, it actually makes it look, look as though the boat's actually moving up and down on the water. So it all adds to the effect. But, uh, yeah, that looks pretty pretty nice. I've had to adjust the trees, obviously, on the on the river itself, just to just to get that boat sat in. But like I said, when you zoom in, you know, front and front and back, there is water all the way around the boat, so it looks, you know, it looks pretty good, sat on that water. Um, so going back to this deco here, it's exactly the same with this small one. Obviously, where the wheels are, you put the trees up against it, and uh, so you've got the shape of the of the boat. I couldn't leave it. I put it on the on the river to start with, and I thought, "Oh, that looks quite nice." And then I went on to uh, Daisy's stream, and somebody said, "But it's a tractor." So I was like, "Really? A tractor?" So I went along to here, look, and I clicked on it look carnival tr tractor i thought she they're right it's a track oh my goodness I, um so when you look at it now you can see where the chicken sat in the chair look, and you've got the wheel arches you can actually now start to see that it is sort of like a tractor and you've got the headlights on there can you see the headlights at the front <laughs> so i thought oh no i'm not having a tractor on the river but you can actually get it to look like a boat. Um, okay then, so going back to all this deco here. Um, in the town, you can probably make a little promenade through the through the middle of the town. Um, if I go on to Greg's, you will see what they've done here. So again, that's about all you can do. <laughs> Hence the reason that Greg's done exactly the same because there's not a great deal you can do. Um, you can put them on your farm, you know, if you like collecting all the deco, like people like to put stuff on their farm, different things, and make tiny little features, like this area here, 
and some people like to uh what i call hoard they they, they like to just put all their deco on their farm and show everybody what they want which is fine absolutely fine it's nice to see what they've won <laughs> but if you want design wise you know this this sort of stuff there is literally nothing really you can do with it the boat you can do i mean you can you see that now the artificial water and the wheels and the, look how big the cow looks i mean in the real world that 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 boat would tip over so you're just what you're just doing you're just eliminating with those trees you're just eliminating that cow and, and just keeping that the actual boat itself and then you put in the trees up to the base of that boat so it looks as though it's sat on the water this sort of stuff i suppose you could use in the child's play area down on the town but again like i said all you can do is do what is done there is make a procession of um floats going through your town um i can't really do a lot with flowers and stuff like that because it's it's a carnival it's a carnival event so you know even stuff like this i mean we've got this coming i think that's quite a nice little truck isn't it that's quite a nice little truck not too keen on the house that's quite nice i like that canopy going over the uh over the shop that's pretty good um oh there's number two there let's see what we get today three stakes so yeah so to so that viewer that wanted me to do a design with all this sort of the carnival equipment apart from one item there's not a lot you can do mate with the uh with that sort of stuff but again like i said that boat there it is in the carnival form and then there it is on the river just a, a completely different effect and it actually looks you know it looks really smart with the docking area and uh, and it actually goes in you know you've got the great big ship here that comes in with all the crates and everything and when you zoom out it actually looks to scale it, you know because it's a small boat which which you know coincides going in the um the river that we've got um i did show you that the other day the potting area with all the flower pots and the little gardening area that was quite nice um yeah i don't know what else i i did uh, that's all up together oh yeah i got my little dog he's led down there with some barrels in the corner he's still there but uh, yeah that is what i wanted to show you guys that's a highlight you know with a little hammock under the little alcove, alcove in the in the back garden there and the river boat coming down the river let me know what you think in the comments um and if you want any help with the boat and everything i suppose we could do a a little video showing you how you can arrange the trees around and and, and make a river there is a video that i've got how you make this river um, you'll have to scroll down a little bit um, but it does show you how to make the river and then you just fit the boat in into that uh, into that area so again let me know what you think in the comments uh, don't forget hit the subscribe pass on the video to all your friends uh, any of your friends that play the game that haven't subscribed yet get them to hit the subscribe and hit the like button because all the likes do add up and uh, again as always put in the comments if you need any help uh, with any designs we can always do a live design for you guys um, and uh, get your farms looking really really nice so until the next time take care of yourselves from me scatterbrook farm garden designs and molly mop and uh, yeah happy designing and we will see you very soon cheerio